video, working out video. What's up guys? So this is Eric Nobita and today I'm actually not cooking, I'm not lifting weights or I'm not doing anything but making a video not because I want to make a video but because I want to make a video in the future. Does that make sense? Okay, so I've been trying to make videos but struggling with content actually. So in this channel, I want it to be myself and just producing lots of vlogs and just random vlogs. So random that I lost my identity in my channel. So I made some food video, working out video, hanging out video, some barbecue video, just anything. But this is just my, you know, hobby channel, hobby channel. So I actually wanted to start a new channel that is specifically about for food. So you know that I'm a foodie and food is something that I always wanted to react to and just try. And food is something that is very um, cultural and something that everyone will like, regardless of the religion, border, country, ethnicity, and whatever. Here, I want to accept some suggestions. So these are the things that I have actually thought about. So first thing is cooking videos. So as you know, in this channel, I made some Indian food and Korean food, but I am a foodie that just want to try different kinds of international dishes. You know that, right? So I even bought some gears like cutting board and good knives so that I can make some professional cooking videos. So if you guys have some recipes that you want me to try, please let me know. And next thing is snack comparison. So I recently went to a local uh, international snack market, not snack market, international market in Korea. And there were quite good snacks that I actually wanted to try. But those snacks, I get to try by myself. But I just wanted to uh, show you guys how a Korean would feel about that kind of snack. So I actually bought quite a lot of snacks at a local market, international market. I bought about six. Uh, there are tons of like Indian and other snacks that I want to try. But the thing is, the number of snacks in Korea are limited. So if you guys know anywhere I can buy some good international snacks or some Indian snacks, please let me know on the link and I'll just buy it online. And also, you know that Korean snacks, some Korean snacks are very similar to like Indian snacks. I just realized so I want to bring some Korean snacks and show you guys hopefully you will like it and just compare it not to say which one is better but just try just to explore different kinds of snack and tell you guys about Korean snacks hopefully you will like it and hopefully if you guys like me just trying to do the mukbang then maybe I'll just send you some packets to some lucky subscribers Okay, and next thing is food reaction video. So as you know, I have been reacting to some videos, but, and also you guys want me to try some recipes, but I'm getting so many like suggestions that I have to try this, try this, try this, right? But the thing is, I am only one. <laughs> I only have one body and finding ingredients is a bit difficult in Korea. So if you want me to indirectly, at least indirectly, uh, try to discover your culture's food, Please let me know. Just share me the link about like a recipe or like street food reaction or something. Then I'll just watch the video and at least I get to indirectly appreciate your suggestion. So please just leave me on the comment section. And last thing that I want to do is the international restaurant re review versus Korean restaurants. So I know that there are so many good Korean restaurants in Korea, of course, because this is Korea. but. Also, there are so many good international restaurants that maybe only foreigners living in Korea would know. So hopefully if there are some subscribers living in Korea, like international subscribers, and you know this restaurant in Korea, let me know. I'll make sure to go there, hold my GoPro, hold my camera, and make some good videos and share it to you guys. So that when you guys come to Korea, you not only get to experience Korean food, but also get to try some good restaurants, you know? of your country not only just your country but just different kinds of culture you know and also just show you guys about korea like what i want to show you guys like what korean people eat normally so i'll just do some mukbang videos in like some local korean restaurants and international restaurants so if you guys have any recipes like that are easy and you want me to try but require little ingredients because they are a bit 
difficult to find <laughs> let me know and if there are some korean recipes that you want me to cook for you please let me know i know that there are so many good you know korean youtubers making korean recipes but i can be one of those right so please let me know just leave me in the comment section below and all the videos and ideas that you share and if i get to make the video following your advice and suggestion i will leave a credit on the videos that i'll be producing so please send me a message oh and also make sure to send me a message through instagram my instagram link will be uh, listed down in the below in the comment section and the description section so please let me know and make sure to follow me and also keep updated because i'll be making some exciting videos you know that right i'm always exciting but i'll be more exciting as i get older and i'm turning 30 years old next year okay anyway unnecessary and i'll see you guys next time hopefully with more exciting videos and bye bye